Hey everyone, and welcome back to Terraria. This is actually a backup video that I'm just recording because my other recording failed. Uh, and by failed, I mean like it was, it crashed and burned. I had a glitch, it was paranoidal activity, I had a glitch, ruin, um, one run, doors didn't spawn, and then the next run I lost power, and the video got completely corrupted and it's totally just lost. And it was pretty much one of the fav my favorite videos that I ever had. Those, both of the runs were insane. And then uh, it was also just definitely my favorite Paranautical Activity video. So anyway, Terraria, like I said, this is happening instead. We're going to the jungle this time. Um, oops. Oh, right. I don't have my mouse. Um, I don't have my mouse thing set up anymore because I just migrated to the new computer. This is still 780p because um, I would play in 1080p just like I would have before. But uh, I'm thinking of the mobile viewers mostly, as well as the people with small screens, because uh, it's much easier for them to view the 720p content. So this is visible for everyone, and as much as I'd like to play 1080p, because it's the only like it's my it, it's the only way I'd play the game if it were only for me. Uh, I just can't really do that, because uh, gotta keep everyone happy if possible. And hopefully, I don't lose power during this recording as well. Because that would suck. But here's hoping, basically. Just gotta keep going. I'm getting a couple, like, skips every so often. But I'm gonna assume that my computer is... Well, no, my computer shouldn't still be starting up. I don't know. I'm just gonna hope for the best that this gets over itself. So we did get our Magnet Sphere last time. And we also still have our Golden Shower. And basically the Magnet Sphere, though. Amazing. And it's Mystic, so that's one of the better Reforges. And we're going to the jungle because we're looking for Chlorophyte. We need 324 because it takes 6 Chlorophyte ore to make one bar, not 5. Uh, so we need 54 Chlorophyte bars. And uh, then we can combine it with our 54 Ectoplasm and have Chlor or Spectre Armor, which will allow us to gain health 8% of the damage we deal with magic uh, weapons. So basically it's just a way to recover like incredibly viably, incredibly well. And it's awesome. So that's basically our next goal, and hopefully we can also find some life fruit, although I don't necessarily count on it. Uh, I would like to. So that's kind of where we stand right now. We're just gonna get to the jungle and then hope for the best. I think it is right after this corruption. I seem to recall the mud, you know, being uncorruptible, and then that being the transition. Incorruptible, I suppose. Yep, see? Exactly as I said. There's the transition, although we're losing some of that dirt, I guess. I assume that was dirt. So we just need to find our way to wherever it is I went underground. And then we're good. Uh, okay, it looks like it's right there. Oh, right. Don't need to keep mashing. By the way, uh, audio balance will probably be different again. So if it's too quiet, like it might be, sorry, uh, let me know. I will pull the uh, audio back up a little higher. I just had to set this up in a hurry since uh, I got like no sleep, so I kind of want to go to bed soon. Oh, this is a different cave. Let's see if it's a good cave. Okay, I need to destroy stuff. Let's see what's in here. I do want the iron, and I'll take the iron skin potion. I don't really care about the rest. Okay, and I want to just check. Oh, look at you. You're so fancy. Yeah, I don't care about you. This seems like a dead end of a cave. So we'll just go back to where I was going originally, which is the cave that I've been messing around with. And uh, this is the right one. Yeah. And hopefully find life fruit and all that stuff, like I said. The goals. But now we have a magnet sphere, so everything should become a fair amount easier. Remember, I like I said, I don't have my macros right now because I just forgot to set them up again. So I need to be diligent with pressing uh, buttons, numbers, to switch weapons and stuff. So it could be scary. It could. I really can hardly hear this. So I'm going to be honest. I expect it to be pretty low. 
I can hear it, but it, I don't know. Then again, my audio drivers are different, so I could be just totally crazy and it's the same. I just don't remember the audio level I put it at in Windows, so. Uh, yeah, migrating to a new computer. Can't migrate everything. I did have to reinstall Windows and stuff. Re do uh, hard drive configurations, all the good stuff. So what I'm doing is, what is that? Okay, it's nothing. Like I said, looking for life fruit, and uh, I haven't been paying a ton of attention, but I'm looking for chlorophyte as well. So I should pay more attention for that, basically, because <laughs> I uh, wouldn't want to fail my whole objective just because I'm stupid. So far, though, I haven't seen like any chlorophyte. So basically, you can farm chlorophyte as well. To do so, you would pretty much just leave one chlorophyte, or just take a bunch of mud and then put one chlorophyte in it. Just leave one chlorophyte in every um, thing you mine. I need to... just a second. There we go. Uh, I was getting a little bit framey there. Oh wait, no. It's still, still doing it a little. I think we're good now, though. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. Alright. I just, I would like to find stuff, but I just can't. This game isn't kind to me very often. That's a lie, it's kind to me all the time. It's just when I really want it to be kind, it's not. Okay. Basically, I get things that are crazy and awesome, and then I don't get the crazy awesome things that I need. Actually, I don't get the normal things that I need. I get the crazy awesome things just fine. What is that? Is that like bee wings or something? I don't even know. Oops, I don't need to use that. Can we switch to the right weapon? Alright, Wisp. Show me what you're made of. Uh, no life fruit up here. Oh, I can just walk up here. Silly me. Alright, let's go up here and see... No life fruit. By the way, you can no longer um, rot of discord into the dun the dun dun jungle temple, which means that no longer do I have to worry about that. I should just farm Plantera and get keys for the hard mode keys, and uh, that's about it. Yeah, this is definitely quieter. Just I'm not sure how much quieter. No life fruit. No chlorophyte. I really do need some chlorophyte ore one of these days. Remember, the magnetsphere does disappear when it hits a wall. And for now, it's not offering us the same benefit as it will when I have spectre armor. Okay. Oh, can that hit you? No, evidently not. Okay, we need to be able to jump here. Where did you go? I should grapple more than I do. For sure. Does that mean I will? Eh, I kind of wouldn't count on it. That's another Plantera bulb, and this is actually a pretty good area for a Plantera fight. If I had to be honest with everyone. Um, I, good drops and things. It might be worth it. Oh my god, so enemies. Uh, that is not Chlorophyte, sadly. Nor is there Life Fruit afoot. Life Crystal's good. Can smash that. Okay, let's just explore a little. Don't need that. Anklet of the wind would be nice. That's not an anklet of the wind. Take the gold, don't need the platinum. Take the eye, take this. Ghost? So spooky. Night owl potion could be helpful. I don't actually have the space for these potions. I really just want an anklet though. I don't think you understand. Then I can make the lightning boots. Everybody's happy. You know, that that's a good life, I, I think. Okay, you need to just stay away. So what is this thing I picked up? Where is it? Oh, immunity to poison. That's awesome, then. That's another piece of my Ankh shield, or Ankh charm first, and then Ankh shield. That I will eventually hope to make, not that it's at all guaranteed at any point. Because it takes a lot of farming and luck and stuff. You need every debuff immunity item 
and then you need to craft them all together. Where is all... Hey, that's a life root. Five more health. 20 of them get me to a max of 500. I'm glad we found that. And now we do know a Plantera bulb, which I might deal with immediately. Well, not immediately, immediately, but pretty immediately. I just want life fruit, though. And an anklet. No, but that's worth selling. Platinum, don't care. So much exploring to be doing. Wow, it's warding, too. You're just, you're hilarious, this game. You are hilarious. Could have used that a while ago. Uh, that's okay, though. That's a life fruit. Okay. In business is what we are. Oh, that's not good yet. There we go. And then let's just do it like this. Life fruit. There's a lot of exploring to do in this jungle, and I like it. There we go. Everything die. I really need that to happen. Magnet sphere, so good. You're gonna see a lot of the magnet sphere being used. Cause it's uh, really, really good. Doesn't look like life fruit in there. I'm gonna assume it's not. By the way, uh, I think I already said it, but I really hope to not lose power again, cause of course, Terraria, a lot happens, and it's all important to catch. Mostly, I guess. You might not care a ton, but it, it's it's generally pretty important to not miss stuff. Okay, life crystal. And it uh, won't be too hard to find the Plantera bulb again. Oh god, you need to be dead. Okay, that, that's a little scary. So we do have 410 health now. Since we've gotten two life fruit. Just flying about, poking my spear. Spear? Yeah, it's a spear. At everything. Seeing what we can see. And hoping that what we can see is life fruit. Hey, that is life fruit. Okay, not you. There we go. So we're getting into business now. Another Plantera bulb. This one's in a less opportune area for sure. But it is good having a scout of them. Oh, look, nature's gift. Everyone's like, hey, you should make a mana flower. It's not really worth my inventory space, to be honest. But, uh, hey, I can still have one. There's also a life uh, crystal right next to that Plantera bulb. So that's interesting, I suppose. Hey, hey, switch. Thank you. Nope. Please, thank you. Again, search everything and everywhere. Break you and you and you. Fly over here. Give me what I want. More fuel claws. I do want a Spelunker Potion. Uh, I don't need that, or that, or that. Don't need gold bricks. Take you. It's just selling stuff. Stuff to sell is good. Uh, again, it might be smart to kill Plantera a few extra times. By which might, I mean definitely would be. There's a lot of potential gain from getting the extra items and such either money or actually items you want to use. Okay, uh, thanks. Just be dead. No life root in there, it doesn't look like, but I can walk here, so I may as well find out. For sure. Yeah, no life root. That's fine. So since I haven't really been paying enough attention, I haven't seen any chlorophyte, and... Well, <laughs> what can I do? Pay more attention, maybe. But it's usually pretty evident. Okay, another Plantera bulb. Uh, these are going to appear on our maps, though, so we, we can totally just find them. 
Anklet of the Wind. Okay, there we go. Uh, I want you and you, you, you. Great. So now we can make lightning boots. Do I have an aglet? I might not have an aglet. Never mind. Uh, we can't make lightning boots without an aglet. Assuming we do have an aglet, though, then we can do it. So that's that's good. I would like to have lightning boots. They're faster just than specter boots. They allow me to run faster. And probably move faster. In general. Okay, nothing in there. Just gotta make sure. So many vines. Such overgrowth. I really like the extra light range we get from Gungnir. It's quite nice to have. Skeleton Archer, yeah, you know, why not? Oh god. There we go. That could have easily been bad. Oops. Knew I'd make that mistake, quite honestly. There we go. Oops, I did it again. You played with my heart. You know, all, all the good stuff. Alright. Something's got to die. Life root hunt might be the most important thing we could do right now, I guess. In which case, that's exactly what I'm doing, and I'm not seeing chlorophyte, so it's not like I can mine it. So I guess, you know, life root works. 415 isn't bad. Of course, 500 is the ultimate goal. But you don't get there immediately. Baby steps. Okay, it feels like there should be some life root about here. Life root be afoot. I mean, don't literally be afoot, but... You know, be, be somewhere. Because, I mean, obviously, fruit is not feet. Okay. Alright, I'll kill you, because you're... Wow, you can just... There you go. Get down there. Yeah, alright, I'll, I'll come down. And then I'll break in here. It is so nice having the wisp, though. And, uh, is this the end of this path? Pretty much. Pretty much. Yeah. Alright, it's fine. We can go lower now. Oh, look at all these enemies. That is just downright silly. Okay. Magnet Sphere does work. For sure. Uh, so we came from here. Oh, you need to die. Poisoning me, not good. Then again, I do have immunity to the poison debuff if I want. What is with the ghosts, man? Nope. Makes sense to kill things. Money. How much I have? Six gold? That's not bad. Not amazing either, but it's better than not having six gold. Okay, blazing new ground. Okay... Don't think I won't. Silt, uh, not silt. Oh, there's one. Um, yeah, silt is going to be one of the first things that goes if I need to clear inventory space. Okay, let's just shoot this up. Use the life root. 420. Yeah, yeah, I know. One more life root, please. I mean, it really kind of sucks that we're not getting the things I need, which are there's a lot of chlorophyte. But if it hasn't spawned, it just hasn't spawned. That is sometimes life. I should heal. Get over here. I just love the fresh, unexplored area in this jungle. This is a good cave. Okay. Come on. Let's get up here. Band of regeneration. That's good to have more night owl potions. I can pop one, pop the other, because I can. 
Don't need dynamite over the torches. All right then. Don't need to go in there because it's not anything. So many enemies that will all die. All right, up here could be something, I suppose. How much promise does that show? Oh, look, it's a ghost again. And the angry trapper I just can deal with no problem. Okay. Ghost? I don't get you. I wonder what its drop is. If it has a special one. Which I guess I can't guarantee. Okay. See, I hear some things really well. Then the rest of the time it's pretty quiet. Now let's check in there. Since I'm pretty sure I didn't. That's fine. It's better to know that you're not missing anything than to miss something. Have I checked up here already? No, but there's nothing. All right, ghost, of course. Oh, hello, this is serious. Oh, okay, you're dead. You too. Back to the quest for happiness. I don't have any potion sickness right now, which is good. Because that means that if I need to, I can just pop some heals. Which would make my calves look great, of course. Uh, yeah, I'll hit up up there. Okay. Get a magnet sphere in there. This is going better than my life uh, shroom quest previously uh, on my other character. Good thing that didn't just destroy the Plantera bulb, because that, that would kind of sucked. Would have had to have fought Plantera. Not that I shouldn't do that. Oh, well, we found the end of the dungeon. Or not the dungeon, the jungle. So that's an interesting predicament to find ourselves with. Didn't realize I was traveling so far to the side. Where's all the chlorophyte, though? What's up with that? What is up with that? Gravitation potion, I totally want that. Hey then. Alright, let's uh, see if we can handle a quick Plantera fight. Apparently you can't take Plantera above ground anymore. I think is part of the patch. So that's interesting. Uh, this is pretty open, yeah. Definitely really open. This is doable. Alright, let's take it on. It's worrisome. But it should be totally doable. By the way, the Destroyer is also immune to debuffs now. Meaning uh, we can't just, like, Golden Shower destroy it in the same way we could before. Not that I had the Golden Shower in a time where we could do that. Uh, on this character, at least. On my other character, I totally did that. Okay, remember, I've got Mana Cuffs. So I'm set. Taking hits uh, gives me that extra Mana Regen. And we had a much worse setup last time we did this, so we should be okay. I don't know if we had the Golden Shower. We might have. It's not a life uh, fruit, by the way. That's just a plain old water leaf, I think. Okay, can we... The water's bad. Oh, gotta keep the debuff on him. Okay, come on. Okay, I'm taking too much damage. Plantera is angry. Oh, okay. Uh, this is getting a little worrisome. I don't have anything to recover me, really. And those things are pretty threatening, to be honest. Okay. Hits aren't really something I can deal with right now. Okay, 21 seconds of potion sickness. Can I do this? It's a lot easier on the surface or with Spectre Armor. Both of those things are pretty helpful. 10 seconds. Okay, now it's Angry Plantera. We 
we're pretty close to dead, but we're about to get 150 health. Yeah, okay. If we can win this fight, uh, I feel pretty good. And anything is a little helpful that we could get here, probably. Can't be terrible, at least. Okay, can we not? Can we not have this thing going on here, Plantera? Okay, I think I actually made it out of that kind of unscathed, which is amazing. Alright. Cuffs are good. Don't get me wrong. Ah! Ah! Stay away. Stay away for 20 seconds. Please. Oh god. Get up. Get up away. 13 seconds. Okay, those things are homing and terrible. Easily the death of me. Six seconds. Two, one, zero, heal. Chance. Uh, yeah, we've got a pretty good chance of this. Oh god, get away from Plantera, though. Stay away. Can't deal with this right now. Oh no. Oh no. I really do need to not take, like, any damage, essentially. Oop. Okay, okay. Just calm down. Plantera is almost defeated if we can just not make this silly mistake. Yeah, Plantera's a lot easier on the top of the world. Okay, Plantera died. We almost died, but we didn't. Another temple key. Did I get the loot? No. Uh, let's get rid of Torch's pygmy staff. Okay, so that summons a dude to help me out, and that's cool. Oh, we also got that. What can I get rid of? I can get rid of vines. So wasp gun uh, is magic damage, uses six mana, shoots wasps, and those home in on stuff, I believe. Oh boy. <laughs> and this pygmy dude. Uh, now I should make a thing for, uh, I should make some houses, because NPCs. Uh, tiki armor man. I can buy tiki armor, and that'll allow me to uh, have more pygmies, basically. Oh, look at that moth. Okay, okay. I can deal with that. Uh, now I want to get rid of the spores, I guess, because butterfly dust probably allows me to make butterfly wings, which aren't better than what I have. Okay, so a flooded jungle temple. Uh, altar thing. Remember, the jungle's ending over here, so not too much searching to do. Just enough. Oh, right, I was like, why am I so fast? And then I realized I can breathe underwater and stuff. Another anklet of the wind. What can I get rid of right now? Really nothing. Oh, you need to die. So let's do this. And then just toss a ton of stuff in. Oh, mud? I don't need that. Pygmy's just killing stuff. Good part of an AFK farm, if you're into that. Oh wait, I'll keep the pygmies. It's celestial, too. It's pretty good. Wasp gun, probably not concerned with, really. Good job, though, pygmy man. I like you right now. Lots of money, though, made on this adventure. Uh, okay, take this, may as well use the invisibility potion for fun, take the water walking, take the anklet, put them in my piggy bank. Uh, what can I replace with the pygmy staff? Probably nothing for now. 30 summon damage, slow speed, weak knockback, 9 mana. But you can only have one at a time by default. See if I do this again, see he just respawns. 9 mana is not a lot. Okay, anyway, let's put this away take this stuff. You go up here. I should get a safe sometime. Okay, close my inventory. And uh, we need to go elsewhere in the jungle, honestly, because we've reached the far side. Okay, get the life crystal, get this and this, and the thorns potions, because I've been taking those. This is yet another chest that I haven't visited. Cool. Platinum, don't need that. I'll take the healing potions. Nope, oh, you stay away from me. Uh, no. 
No. This pygmy dude. I should keep this on me. This staff is pretty good to have. Still though, no chlorophyte. What is up with that? What is up with that? I think this is around where I stopped going downward in uh, favor of horizontal exploration. So this should be uncharted territory soon to give me nice things. And so it seems so far. This is definitely uh, something I haven't explored yet. So where's all the chlorophyte though? That's what I'm really wondering right now. Oh yeah, sure, I'll break in there. That is chlorophyte. So I'll handle that in a moment. And if I keep one and just put it in some of the mud, uh, I can grow my own chlorophyte, and that'll be nice. And it seems there's more over here, too. Extractinator's worth selling. Gravitation potion, healing, and uh, I may as well use a hunter potion, I guess. Shows me enemies. Just want to check out the rest of the world here. There's not a lot of chlorophyte, and I need a lot. Which is unfortunate. But I will grab all of it for now. And I guess I'll destroy this. Or a calcum. So, finally we find any, though. Okay, you just stay away from me. Pygmy's doing his thing. Which is better than having the pygmy not do anything, I guess. Alright, fine. Not gonna mess with you. And I should just make a chlorophyte farm above ground for convenience sake. Okay. Move out of the way just to make sure we didn't miss any. We're good. Man, look at this thing go. So much... I mean, he's just useful. I don't know if he actually draws aggro, but he, he is helpful. Just want to check out what's life like down here, and there's chlorophyte. Uh, that's, that's okay. That's good. Uh, let's... Oh, we don't have torches, of course. That's fine. Oh, stop shooting. Can you? Thanks. I don't know why that happens. I mean, I know why that happens. I just don't know why they changed that. Okay. All the chlorophyte there is now mine. I could be using Spelunker potions, and that would help me find, um life fruit as well, but I, I don't know. I have a kind of serious case of too good to use with, oh god, with Spelunker potions. So I'm just not going to do that too much. So I don't want to really mess with the lava down there, if possible. Oh, look, there's a war fight that I missed. And before Salt Factory in the comments, because I know you're all mad at me for it. Okay, we're like, 300 isn't hard to get, it's just that, well, 354 or whatever. It's not hard to get, it's just that it takes a while if you can't find any, like I apparently have just now reached. Uh, like, on other worlds, I found it, like, as soon as I went down into the jungle, instead of just now getting to it uh, at the very bottom of the jungle. I don't know if that's changed, or if uh, I haven't given it time on this world, or if I'm just really unlucky. I don't know. Goodie bag, that's exciting. Adhesive bandage, that's another debuff immunity. Okay, and I may as well look around. That seemed intriguing, so I'm probably going to go there. And we're immediately met with more lava. That's annoying. Just looking for chlorophyte with my wisp, which is pretty nice that he can do that. So I guess I'll drain down here. Oops, come on, shift to the weapon I want you to. Can we get out of there? Thanks. Uh, Alright. Wisp. My eyes are starting to hurt from the way the lighting is working. Oh, I wonder if my settings transferred over with the save, because this might be on, like, pretty or something. The lighting just might be different. It might not be as well, though. Chlorophyte. Good, good, good. It's been surprisingly short so far. 
It's also been a really good adventure. So far. But a good adventure so far is a good adventure overall. I would pause it at least. I was hoping I saw life fruit. I didn't. Come on, here we go. Good work, Magnet Sphere. Chlorophyte, more, more. It's my goal in life. Careful of all of these enemies. There are too many of them. I what was that down there? There's something down here. Oh, it was a glowing man. Oops. Pygmy just kind of comes to me every so often. All right, let's go back up a little more. We have explored a lot of the jungle now, though, which is pretty cool, I would say, uh, since we had previously explored very little of it. Is that another nature's gift in there? I mean, probably worth selling. No, it's not. Okay, that's fine. Chlorophyte. Up there. There we go. Leave me alone, bat. How's my chlorophyte? Ugh, 80. Okay. That's not terrible, honestly. Uh, okay. Wisp, you're not giving me enough light. Good, good. I mean, yes, those are just unholy arrows. Don't get me wrong. It's not about the arrows, it's about the area. <sighs> Wisp, come back. But it's okay, Wisp still solves my light problems, really. Okay, let's just not get lava all over us. Wouldn't that be unpleasant, just getting lava all over yourself? I don't even want to... I don't want it. How long does this pygmy last? Like, freaking forever? Because that's cool. Thanks, Plantera. You are a bro. That was also, like, that Plantera fight was definitely pretty harrowing. Which is good. And exciting for... Wow, that's nice. Can I at all... No, that's not happening. Okay, uh, let's not do anything rash, by which I mean let's just go elsewhere. It's not really worth it. I have the anklet. I just need aglet if I don't already have one. Okay. All right, let's just tunnel. Okay, let's, and not waste all of our ammo. I mean, at least we haven't made different types of ammo that we're wasting. But like, seriously, come on, Terraria. Why would I want to shoot there? In here, we have another magic mirror and uh, nothing to. This freaking pygmy needs to do a lot of work. I mean, it is. So I guess that's all I could really ask for. Um, let's see, where I need two of you. Oh, you are coming awfully close to me. Uh, place the piggy bank. And then in the piggy bank, place all of my possessions. Uh, is there anything at quick stack? Yes. I don't actually want this statue. It doesn't help me. I'm probably going to pick it up again in a moment. Extractinator, cloud in a bottle, don't need the cobwebs. Mm, I guess I don't need you or you. I do want to keep the um, chlorophyte, though. I want to hang on to that. Adhesive bandage. You. I'll also hold on to the mud, because why not, I guess. All right, then. Let's make this happen. There's a bunch of chlorophyte. That is good. Oh, fine. You want to be a jerk about it. I get it. I get it, Terraria. I don't have that kind of range. Fine. Which is kind of amazing that I don't. Okay, up here. Wisp. Wisp! You're not helping me there. Uh, is that all of it? Yes. Yes, it is. Life fruit. That's a mimic over there. Uh, well, I definitely want to fight that, honestly. Because I need Mimic Drops, they can give me pretty cool stuff. Wow, everyone's just immediately angry with me. Okay, uh, Mimic, goodbye. Ah, oh, yes, a cross necklace, that's perfect. 
I already have the um, Star Veil thing that has stars attack enemies when I get hit. And you can combine that with that, and uh, what the Cross Necklace does is it increases the amount of time you're invincible after taking damage. So it's pretty nice. Uh, and, oh, Life Fruit, excellent. Doesn't get much better than that. Uh, so let's pop our Life Fruit, 425. Gold bricks in here, another Anklet of the Wind. Well, I mean, there's no shortage of them now, which is good, I guess. Sellable. Let's keep exploring. I mean, this is exactly what I'm here for. That and Chlorophyte. Um, but every little life fruit is a nice victory in my life. There's Titanium over there, but I don't honestly care about it. I'm here for Chlorophyte and life fruit. That's it. Honeycomb. I don't think we fought the Queen Bee here. I think we did fight the Queen Bee, but I don't think we fought this one. More life fruit. That is pleasing, to say the least. Okay, life fruit once again. May as well kill the Queen Bee, though. Uh, so we're going to get some bees here, but in, in the honey, our life regen is improved. I don't really need the hives, even though we're probably going to get, like, a hive wand or something. So, honey, more life regen. Shadow dodge, of course, because of stuff. Man-eater is in there. Whatever. We don't... Oh, I didn't even mean to destroy that there, but that's fine. There we go. Yeah, this isn't going to be too bad. Just go into the position where I can kill you. It's so little health compared to what the damage I do is. Alright, I'll grab... Oh, it's not worth it. Wait on you. It hardly does any damage to me. Not threatening at all. Pygmy's also doing work. Hey, Queen Bee. I'm not here to have you troll me. I'm just here to kill you quickly. Alright, fine. Die there. Queen Bee Trophy, Bee Gun. Uh, is there any other drop that I've missed? Cobweb. Uh, no? Yeah, no, I didn't miss any drops. So that's good, I guess. Away we can go to... that. I thought that was Life Root for a second. I was like, oh my god, yes! It wasn't. Still, 4.30. It's, it's good. I don't have any more sitting around. Honey block. Oh yeah, that's a thing. I forgot. Oh, honey is so sticky. Well, honey blocks are so sticky, I should say. I just want some left fruit. Okay, um, let's handle this like smart people. There we go. That is how smart people handle it. And the more rightward we go, the more close we get to the other side. Maybe we'll find the dungeon. Wouldn't that be hilarious? I mean, we already found the end of this, of the left side, so it's not like it's impossible. You know, the, the pygmy is really good. I appreciate the pygmy. Plantera bulb. I don't want to mess with that after last time, although there's still definitely plantera drops that I want to get. Uh, let, let's wait for... Is this another hive? That's just silly. And is this, like, armor polish? No, it's just his head, or whatever. Oh, uh, yeah. I don't want to kill the plantera bulb. Which I think you'll find is an understandable concern. What is that? Oh, it's just a jungle creeper. That's okay. I just want to look around a little bit. We found a bunch of plantera bulbs, though, and we can definitely find those on our map, no problem, if need be. It's like, oh, I need to farm plantera. Good thing I found, like, 16 bulbs. Oh, a house. Okay. Sure. Sure. What do you have for me? Sure, Hermes boots. I'm, I'm cool with that. And away we go once again. 37 gold is not a bad haul. Uh, I don't want to deal with this again. I'm going to be honest, I really don't. I'm here for Chlorophyte and whatever else. Whatever else. Uh, yeah, not going to mess with that one. It's funny that it's right next to the other one, though. 
Yep, there's the queen bee thing. And we can always find that with our map as well. We know exactly where it is, pretty much. Uh, well, we know it's somewhere in the jungle. Not a big deal. Wisp, you need to come back so I can see. I don't know if you've realized that, maybe. Okay, he's lava. He is lava. This freaking pygmy. Seriously, forever. And that's so good. Alright, a little bit of chlorophyte. Come on, come on. Oh, we filled our stack. That's good. 99, yep, that's one stack, so I don't need the gold bricks. Okay. Again, I want to explore laterally rather than... Uh, I don't know if laterally is the word I wanted to use. I want to explore side to side, not vertically for now. Uh, at least not vertically in a negative direction. I don't want to go down. Tattered B-Wing for some B-Wings. I think I already have that, but those, like, still, the materials for wings sell high. Where's my pygmy? Come back. I miss you. Hey, hey, hey! Goodness. Okay, now let's... Okay, this is a nice situation we find ourselves in. Don't need the honey block. Don't need... Beanades, that's kind of awesome. Oh god. Okay, let's heal here. Pygmy, what are you doing with my life? Besides letting it end for your own sick enjoyment. Uh, I want the healing potions. Okay. Life crystal. You. Healing potions I actually don't have space for. Spelunker potion. Where are those? Oh, they're in my... Okay, let's uh, place that again. Oh, come on. You're going to need to do better than that. Wait, the pygmy gives me uh, the bonus for shadow dodge? That's awesome. Oh, God, no, 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 no. That's not okay. Okay, tag. Wing cross. That's good, and it's warding, but sadly we have to uh, get rid of it anyway. Okay, I'm about to heal because I was dying. Uh, can we quick stack anything else? Yes. B gun. Can you not hit me? Oh my god. We're getting scared. Okay, I can put away you and you. Get rid of these, and oh my god. Pygmy. Well. Piggy bank. 100 life, lots of potion sickness remaining. Grab all the health I can. There's a lot of money out here. Which I guess doesn't matter if I die, I lose half my money anyway. But we were doing pretty well, so let's go back to that. We've got just over 100 Chlorophyte. We need 354, I believe we determined. Flare gun and flares. I mean, it sells high. 40 gold, and I'll keep the flares, because I have a stash of those. And of course, I only need one flare gun. It's titanium. That's not what I'm here for. Life Crystal. Sells high. It's really what you get them for after you have 400 life. That's a little bit of Chlorophyte. I've probably missed plenty, and you're saying, you're saying just use a freaking Spelunker Potion. And you're not wrong. Not even a little bit. In fact, you're so right that I would go so far as to say that you're right. Because you can't really be more right than right. When you think about it, either you're right or you're not. Life fruit. 435. Uh, it's progress. Of course, we would ultimately like to end up at 500, but what else is there? <laughs> you can't you can't get there without taking the intermediate steps. All right. Okay. 
Oh, hello. I would like to be not poisoned. That's my goal in life, is to not get poisoned. It's a pretty, pretty simple goal, honestly. I think that most people is, it's something that most people would accomplish. See, that time we didn't mega shark things. Okay, why don't we place a torch here? Extra light is helpful. Okay, can you all die? Because I'm not having a good time with you. Grab all this chlorophyte. 300 isn't unreasonable. Like, we can totally do that. It's just that my inventory is uh, starting to feel the burn because I never bought a safe. Which would be a smart thing to have bought, by the way. Life fruit, I see it. I do see it. That's that's something we're here for. That is definitely one real goal. Really, my inventory is already full again? My god. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll probably go up there. Just giving it a look around. Making sure of life. I mean, this has been a really successful escapade out into the world, so I going back to clear out my inventory, get rid of all this cash I'm carrying, all that stuff, wouldn't be bad. It'd just be time-consuming, not that I haven't spent the last 50 mil 51 minutes here anyway. Everyone can use a little brief respite. It's quite helpful, in fact, when you have no space for life. Okay, I can't have you being here at all. Lava charm, okay. Uh, I don't need this. Don't need these. Alright. I'm cool with the way things are going at the moment. Is that chlorophyte? That's totally chlorophyte, isn't it? Yep, okay, we're tunneling. Inward. Okay. It's tough when you can't see due to your wisp not cooperating. Okay, here we go. Chlorophyte ore. Let's see as much of it as we can. I do need to go back, though. Like, next time I fill up my chlorophyte, it might be time to go back. Uh, I'm not sure yet. I haven't decided. Basically, it's as much my decision as it is necessity. Because I can keep making things work, it's just a matter of when am I ready to not have to make them work and just have them work. And that's, well, that's the question right now. More health. Excellent. You can die. There's some chlorophyte that I think I might have missed earlier. I don't know. This is actually totally higher up than I was. So I think that this is new. A completely new area, that is. Okay. Chlorophyte ore. Oh, hello, armored skeleton. I don't like you, and you don't like me. Let's uh, agree to let you die. Oh, look, more chlorophyte. Oh my god, stop that. Oh, okay, I could get it, it's just not when I want to start with it. I can't do that. That would be stupid to allow me to do that. Okay. So freaking hard to tell what's going on. But uh, this isn't a situation where shine potions would be helping that. Plantera bulb. Gotta be careful not to destroy that. I don't want to fight Plantera. Although this is a relatively good area for it. Uh, since this is pretty open. But here I am. Alright. I can get all the chlorophyte I need. And then I can have spectre armor at the end of the episode. That's definitely happening. Now that we have the ability to get the chlorophyte. I mean I should set up a farm. A solar eclipse is happening. Oh man, I really need to get on that. Oh, I should do that right away. I'm not going to do it. No, I can't say that. I can't say that at all. I can't seriously say that I'm going to pass up a solar eclipse. All right. Magic mirror. 
I need to put away things very quickly. No, not you. Uh, so enemies are probably going to get in here. No, go away. Quick stack. Basically what I can get here is broken hero swords. Incredibly valuable because those allow me... Okay, okay, everyone out of the house. Out of the house right now. We're going to be over here. This could easily kill me, but anyway, broken hero swords would be really mighty nice because those would uh, allow me to forge um, true Knight's Edge, true Excalibur, and uh, together I would be able to forge um, the Terra Blade. Now, my first Solar Eclipse... Oh, yep, you guys are dying. So I'm probably not going to have the same NPCs. This is a really good impetus for me to uh, build more houses. Come on. Come on. This is going to be hard. And I didn't clear out much inventory space. This is also a pretty big source of um, goodie bags and uh, various other bonuses. This is... See, it would have been really nice if I didn't get this until I had um, Spectre Armor. But I didn't really have control over that. As long as I get one Broken Hero Sword, I don't really care what happens. But uh, I'd prefer to get two. Note that True Knight's Edge is better than a, a True Excalibur, even though you get um, Excalibur later than Knight's Edge. I guess it's just mixing it up a little. Okay. Okay. Gotta get some good damage in there. Nobody's dropping things. I need more drops. And this is daytime note, because uh, it's a solar eclipse, so it's day. Okay, and uh, when we're done with this, it'll be night, and maybe something silly will happen at night, too. Like a blood moon. But I don't need to farm the blood moon. I only need to farm this for broken hero swords. But this was... I, I mean, this really was the perfect impetus for me. Impetus is the word of the moment. Uh, for me to uh, actually just go out of the dun uh, jungle and clear out my inventory issues. We only lost the bottom floor of our house, as far as NPCs are concerned. So note that the drop rate for the Broken Hero Sword is pretty low. And I mean, there are also other, um, other drops that we could get here that would be nice. It's just a matter of, will we get them? Probably not. Jalen was slain. Allure was slain. Alright, so I'm going to have a complete repopulation of NPCs by the end of this night, probably. Yeah, you already told me that Allura was slain. Hey, you want to get up there? Thanks. Oh, he gave me a Moonstone. Okay, so that increases my damage when it's nighttime. And there's also a Sunstone to increase your damage. That's a drop from the uh, Golem in the Jungle Temple. That'll increase your... Actually, it's not just your damage. It's all stats. Increases all stats during the night. Sunstone is all stats during the day. Uh, they do not combine, because that would just be all stats up all the time, which uh, I think would be a little silly. But you can always just swap them out. One for the night and one for the day. So that's cool. Uh, I don't have any other inventory space. I got a Swamp Thing banner. That's cool, I guess. Because there are plenty of Swamp Things, that's for sure. Goodie bag, that's excellent. If uh, only I could do something to pick it up. Oh, you know what? I don't need the silt. I told you it would be the first thing to go. If I really got into a situation where I needed to do, do so. Okay. There's a broken hero sword. Um, Swamp Thing Banner, screw you. Broken hero sword. Those stack, by the way. Broken hero sword stack up. Okay, I don't need that. I trashed the Swamp Thing Banner by accident. Not a big deal. I don't care about the banners and um, stuff. Okay, so then we're going to do some like insane inventory management and selling and stuff. We're going to have lots of money to make. Anyway, we can finally replace our beam sword with another weapon, another sword. True Knight's Edge, of course. You know what? This might be an even better area than the last one for farming. Wow, that was still going. I mean, seven seconds is a while, I suppose. Alright, I just need more broken hero swords. Preferably two more in the first night. My first solar eclipse on my other character... I did get two. Uh, my second one only saw one between me and my friend. So, it's pretty much just pure luck. But at least I got one. 
so I can make the True Knight's Edge. And that means that I will be changing up my Quick Select a little bit. Uh, and I'll be reordering them, since uh, True Knight's Edge is definitely worth having earlier on than I have the Beam Sword right now. So that's pretty exciting. I'm happy about the way things are going at the moment. Okay, and everything that spawns here has a chance to give me the Broken Hero Sword. I really want to keep Gungnir on, like I really do. It's pretty nice to have. Since uh, the light, as I was showing you, like it's excellent when used for light. Keeping that up would be pretty helpful. Yeah, I, <laughs> I could not have ignored the solar eclipse. That would have been such a bad idea. I love how the pygmies ride the staffs and stuff. Come on, another broken hero sword. I've only gotten one. Stacked to 99, and they're not actually common enough for that to matter. Unless you're crazy lucky and take a lot of um, a lot of uh, eclipses to find them all. I haven't been losing much health anymore. Like I figured, I figured it out. And we're gonna do this all day. This is this is the entire day, and we're only about halfway there. With one broken hero sword to show from it, that's not a bad set of odds. Also note that uh, those ghostly apparitions with the sides do give you a weapon, and it's, it looks, it seems like a magic weapon, but it's actually a melee weapon, and it's uh, the scythe, basically, and you just shoot this purple scythe that can damage things through walls, so that's really nice and useful to have, and it's a lot of melee damage, so that's also a positive to it. So many swamp things. Although it's really rare, so I, I wouldn't expect to get that drop, basically, is what I'm saying. Alright, you didn't give me anything. Okay, calm down, Mr. Reaper. You know, I like this pygmy. He's a bro. He is a nice dude. Oh, look at you, Zom... Izor. Okay, no, no, stop hitting me. I was doing well before things were shooting me and attacking me. Okay. Thank you, Pygmy. You are still a bro. You're still a nice individual. Alright, uh, I'm glad that this has such, like, good knockback for not having high knockback as a stat uh, bonus. Oh, need more broken hero swords. So bad. Oop. That's all I want. Okay, give me some regen. Thank you. I should water candle, honestly. That would be a smart thing to do. Uh, but I don't want to be fighting over here. I want to be fighting way over here. Calm yourselves, lads. Get over here. There we go. Good, good combination. Come at me. Preferably from one side. I guess theoretically I could just block one side off. Not have that concern. But how fun would that be? I don't like setting up. No, no, pygmy. You can you can leave them be. We can get them over here. Another goodie bag. That's good. <laughs> pygmy, come back to me. I need your help. I didn't say that you could leave them completely alone. I just said that you could leave them over there and help me over here. All right. So many swamp things. For the amount of things we kill, I would I wish that I'd get more broken hero swords. I mean, of course I do. <laughs> Pretty much the goal of a solar eclipse is broken hero swords. Which is cool. Now that I've lost power, and I assume it was due to the consumption that I was doing... I kind of worry about doing a long video and then losing it, especially in Terraria. Everything is so important to catch, like I was saying earlier. Come on, you got this. I just want them close to me when they die. You? Oh, you too. There we go, another goodie bag. So much inventory management to be done. Another goodie bag. I really like it. 
No scythe, though. And no more broken hero swords. Yeah. Had to check just in case I missed the pickup or something, but I I was pretty sure. I was pretty confident that I didn't. Wow, so many goodie bags. So many goodie bags. I mean, there are cool costumes out there. I would love to get an alien costume. I don't think I've gotten one of those yet. Uh, can we shoot the right thing? No, thanks. Okay. We're almost done. Still on one broken hero sword. The pygmies will fight for you. I'm glad that they'll do that for me. I should make houses soon, but I'm probably not gonna. Smart as it would be, I just don't feel like it. Maybe once I have Spectre Armor, I'll do a building episode. Build like 10 houses. I probably don't need 10, but I need I need a fair number, honestly. So it would be smart to build just a bunch. I think there are like 15 or like 18 NPCs or something. Maybe there are 20. I don't remember the number exactly. I just know I need a bunch of houses. Good lord. Okay, we're getting too far to the side again. Oh, is that a banner? Yeah, it totally is a banner. It's okay, I can run over here for drops again once I've actually cleared my inventory a little bit. Of course, after the eclipse is over. I've already lost enough NPCs. Okay, calm, calm, calm. No death on my first solar eclipse so far. That's pretty good, I would have to say. I mean... Yeah, I knew what I was getting into, but pretty well handled. Ah, uh, I'm a little upset, though, that it happened while I was trying to... I was, like, close to getting my chlorified armor. Uh, not my chlorified armor, my chlorified bars. Oh, and then I need to get it all, like, tons of chlorified again in order to um, make the chlorified armor so that I can have something for melee. No, don't kill it. Thanks. Come back. Reaper, I need you to come back here. Did it kill? Or did it die? Did it get killed? Another Swamp Thing banner? See? Banner's not hard to come by. Hey, no. Let's, let's stop this. Stop this madness. Kill things over here. Oh, so effective in combination. It's okay, Pygmy. You can do it. Alright, Reaper. Clever jumps, all you need. Oh god, an Izor. Stop shooting me. I'm here to not take damage. That's the thing that I need to do. Okay, we're, we're good now. Nope, you tried to... You wanted to hit me. Oh, calm down. Good, Magnet Sphere. Eh. Please, one more broken hero sword. Two more, really, but please, just one more. All I want. It's all I want. You know, offspring. Uh, you know, okay, no, let's, let's... Pygmy, you do a lot of damage, and it's awesome, but I don't want you doing it over here. I don't think it's going to kill anything. It's just a matter of... Can we have everything where I need it to be? Which is over here. Not having to deal with the water. Although I'm totally able to uh, change out my accessories now. Have something better than the uh, moon charm. Or moon shell, or whatever. I can have the uh, star veil. Which is really good. Extra invincibility as well as um, stars to damage stuff. And those provide light. Pretty sweet. Right, let's just heal. Be safe. Broken hero sword. Come on, you can do it. How much gold do I have? 49. That's not bad. I mean, these are very good money earning opportunities as well. Of course. Broken hero swords sell for a lot as well, and I don't need more than three, so if I get more solar eclipses, uh, I can absolutely justify selling as many excess broken hero swords as I can acquire. Which will be nice. Okay, let's toss one of those out. All about the good jumping. Reaper. Uh, Vampire Banner 2. I don't know how much those sell for. I don't think they sell for much, if anything. But I could be making that up completely. 
Having a lot of pygmies would actually be pretty fun. Maybe the tiki guy will move in. I'd be down for that. I mean, seriously, why not? Oh, oh, it's ending. It's definitely ending. Which is sad. I only got one hero sword. But nothing else is spawning, so we did it. Alright, now let's uh, wade through the carnage. Open these... close these doors, rather. I'm sorry that some of you didn't make it. You will be brought back eventually. Okay, flare gun. These. I don't think I have a lava charm. Chlorophyte doesn't sell for much until it's bars, probably. Don't need the boomstick. Don't need the statue. This mushroom. I'll keep that. Celestial pygmy staff. That's so good. Uh, okay. So let's just just for posterity, quick stack everywhere, if at all possible. Okay. Uh, let's place the chlorophyte. All no, I want to keep the chlorophyte on me. Now I need to just find places for everything. Uh, this is full. Wow, I really need to make more chests and things. Or put more chests in places. That's the real solution here. So this uh, is not the one with my chests. This is the one with my chests. Okay, so what we do is we place a chest there. <laughs> yeah. Cheating. Pretty much, at least. And let's also place one here. Housing should still be valid, I'm going to assume. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're good. And then this will be an extra thing for uh, all of our costumes. Loot all. Start stacking again. Oh, wow, I, I've got a plat again. That's cool. Quick stack, we quick stacked all that. Let's quick stack here and here, just in case. Didn't think so. I can sell that. I can't sell. I'll keep both of these. I can sell that. Need to keep that. Adhesive bandage. Do we have that already? On um No, but let's get all of our immunities together. I must have more immunities, right? Right? Maybe more immunities, perhaps? Uh, compass, horizontal position. Oh, I do need the star cloak. Hmm. Do we really not? Because I thought we had at least one more. Ah, armor polish. There we go. But I thought there was another. Probably making that one up. Unless it's in here for some reason. Which I kind of doubt. Pretty certain, actually. Hey, you know what? I'll place this harpy banner. Can't go there, so it'll go in here. Uh, wait. This is... I wonder if this is a material. Okay, it says material. I wonder if that's what it's material for. I suppose is what I'm trying to get at. Uh, okay, let's go back to this. Get the adhesive bandage. I think that's the last immunity we have from this uh, so far. B-wings aren't a higher tier, by the way. Let's uh, loot the stuff. Adhesive bandage. So we're getting there to the Ankh charm. We don't have a guide right now, so we can't check, like, hey, what am I missing? Because uh, we, we can't. Okay, let's talk to someone and sell some stuff. Don't care about those, don't care about you, 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 you. So far we're good, right? Nothing I need. Wasp gun, 10 gold, wow. Uh, I'll keep that though. Same with the pygmy staff, I kind of want to just toss pygmy staff here maybe. Although it seems like this pygmy just never leaves. Cool to have. Definitely cool to have. 15. Um, honestly, get rid of those. I want to keep my light discs, though. I like them. Having them is neat. 
Okay, um, open you up, put my wasp gun, my light discs. Yeah, don't need that. Spelunker potions. Do we have any of those in crates? No, we totally don't, because I used them all or something. Hang on to that. <clears throat> more, more management. Loot all, once again. Not her, I can't sell things to her. Don't need that, that, that. Okay, don't need feral claws at all. Butterfly dust, I'll keep. Band of Regeneration. I need the Star Cloak. I'll keep the bee gun Uh, yeah, I haven't put an anklet away yet. I don't think I have an aglet at all, honestly. So I'm gonna put you there. No, I'm gonna keep that one on me. Butterfly Dust. Uh, yeah, I'll just keep that. Iron Bars, we know where those go. Oh, Violent Hermes Boots. How could I forget? Because they weren't readily apparent. Um, yeah, there we go. Iron Bars is what we needed to put away there. Loot all. Oh, we're almost done. We're so close to done. Okay, I can place the Queen Bee Trophy, because why not? And then I can loot the last thing from this chest, which would be nice. No, they're dead. <laughs> we can't talk to them. Uh, okay, this one sells for 110 This one sells for 132 Okay, sell the more expensive one, of course. Bee Nades. I mean... Yeah, I don't actually care about having them. That sells for so little. What? That's not right. 250 for that as well. What? That is all wrong. <laughs> That's actually straight up incorrect. I don't believe it. Not for a second. Okay. We're good. Stack. I guess I should try and stack. No to this chest where I'll put away the bee wings since I think both of these make wings uh, I need to go to the tinkerer's workshop make this star veil place this uh, spiked 2% damage sure I can roll with that moonshell I will keep though maybe I'll want it one day now I won't know when it's night and I won't have the increased melee damage but that's kind of alright with me uh, do I have any gravitation potions the answer is obviously no. So let's move this here. I don't need it for now. Anklet of the wind. I need to look for an aglet. That's right. I don't... Oh, I do. So clutch. Okay, let's go up here. Make the lightning boots and they're brisk. So more movement speed. Uh, they're just faster. So like that. Um, what else do I need to do? Got my star veil. I have 53 defense, which is alright. Honestly, it is pretty alright. 40 gold, 1 platinum as well. Broken Hero Sword, I guess, can be up next. Knight's Edge, we're gonna get true Knight's Edge. I think I can do this at, down here. Yes, yes I can. There we go. Perfect range. Quick, so it's just speed. 81 melee damage, that's really good. Let's do it like that. Yeah. So it shoots um, a spinning sword. Gungnir, I still will want to have. I need to set up my macros again. But beam sword, don't need you. Now, goodie bags. Princess stuff, I think I have. Witch stuff, I think I have. Rotten eggs, don't care. Robot stuff, I totally have. Cat, I don't think I have, actually. No, I do. Okay, so I have witch, I have princess, I have robot. Uh, okay, so let's sell all of them. I don't know if they sell for like anything slash much at all. Eh, 60 silver is fine. I know those don't sell though. Robot mask. Cool. Let's open these up again. More rotten eggs. Hallow's Eve. Okay, let's put that here. If we apparently can't. Never mind. Um, is there anywhere I can put it? I guess it's a big painting. Well, that's fine then. I will just stash it with the nothing that I acquired from all of those goodie bags, sadly. Shop. I can have those. <laughs> just I'd pay you to take them away from me, basically. I should buy a couple safes, but I'm not going to. Uh, I'm going to put away the golden keys. 
I'm not going to the temple yet if I do get there, so I could put those away. That wouldn't be an unintelligent thing to do. I'm gonna do that. More inventory space is important. But I am gonna hold on to all of my chlorophyte, which is probably not really that recommendable. Don't need the meteorite. Don't really want the campfire. Keep my buff potions, though. Oh, I have an extra anklet of the wind. Oops. Shop and sell. Then I think we're ready to go back to the jungle. 48 gold. Pretty good. One platinum as well. I could reforge something. Many times, probably. Damage, movement speed, movement speed. I mean, these two, totally worth reforging for sure. Definitely worth reforging as well, since I'm not really about me melee right now. Eh, let's take some time. What do I want the most to reforge? Movement speed, probably. The 1% movement speed. Sounds like the smart thing to reforge. Let's roll with it. 16 gold. Uh, arcane, 20 more mana. It's good? Nah. Spiked. 2% damage. Let's roll with that. 2% melee speed. Let's try this now. The merchant has arrived. Oh, that's cheap. Lucky. No. Guarding. Nah. Warding for now. That's cool. More defense is nice. 2% damage. 3% movement speed. Let's give these a go as well. Angry. 3% damage. I'll stick with that for now. 2 defense. Uh, yeah. So I'm much happier with those. Do I want anything else to be reforged? I don't need this Phoenix Blaster anymore. I can put something else there. I can also replace the Demon Scythe. I just don't have the things to replace them with yet. 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 I will. Hmm. I could save my 65 gold and that would be pretty smart. Why don't I do that? It's 85. That definitely was a noticeable increase in the damage that we got with it. Okay. Back to the jungle. Uh, I guess I should turn these into chlorophyte bars. No, I want to go here. Because that will take up less space. Yep, that is less space. Not like I'm going to lose them. Alright, let's just stop wasting time because I need to go back already. Hurry up with the video. It's getting long. It's getting late. I haven't slept nearly enough. Etc. So back to the jungle we go, and now I don't have to worry about water screwing up my flight, which is quite nice, I would have to say. So I'll just fly away and have grand, grand times back in the jungle. Let's look at the map, by the way, just see where. Wow, we didn't do totally a ton. Does that say chlorophyte? I saw chlorophyte somewhere. Yep, uh, I totally did. It's cool, though. Not insanely worried. Uh, I could, I should have gone with the um, crystal ball, but that's okay. So we'll get up to chlorophyte armor, and then we will, um, or not chlorophyte, again, specter armor, and then we'll end the episode, and then next time we'll build some houses, and then I'll go from there. Farm Plantera a few times, maybe? Not sure yet. Specter armor pretty much is the prerequisite for everything else that we want to do, though. Maybe it's almost time. That we still have to kill the twins. Spectre Arm will make that a lot easier, though. Uh, maybe we go for a Pumpkin Moon relatively soon. I do want to get a lot of money, though, so I can uh, reforge everything to really good prefixes. Modifiers, if you will. Eh, lots to do. Lots to do. Arms dealer has arrived, so we're still sticking with the same people, it looks like. Even though I totally meet the requirements for many others. That's fine, though. It's totally fine. So we're here at the Corruption for the last... Oh, yeah, the Star Veil. I forgot about you. So good. More invincibility, like I said, and the stars. So we're about to get to the jungle. Basically is what I was trying to say. We... There's the jungle. And then we just have to get further down in the ground so we can find chlorophyte again. Although, evidently, I missed some. Yeah, true knight's edge. So good. 
Okay, so that's not what's important right now. And then this is where we went down, I'm pretty sure. Yes, absolutely. Uh, this should also emit some light, but honestly, Gungnir. Honestly, Gungnir. I feel that that was all really successful, though. Like, this has gone exceedingly well. Okay. I mean, yeah, I can't breathe underwater anymore, so that kind of sucks. But uh, think about what I've gained. It's pretty good. Okay, so I need to just know where I'm going. Okay, there's only one way to go, and it's down. Which is exactly where I want to be. Um, then I want to... Oh, wow, I need to do a big loop if I want to get all the way where I was. Unless, of course, I can find my way through elsewhere. Okay, no, no plantar ball, but I do remember finding that, so that's good. This could be unexplored? Nah, not really. Right, I need to... You know what, let's, uh, let's tunnel. Mix it up, go somewhere else that we haven't been. Remember, I do have to worry about drowning. But that's easy enough. Is that a single chlorophyte? Oh, stop that with the ammo wasting. Yep, a single chlorophyte that I didn't let grow. Dryad, sure. Uh, breath meter, you're taking up precious space on my screen. See, really, with 1080p, there's just so much less to worry about on the screen. Because it's just not, no, nothing's taking up so much space. And yeah, I know, it's just too much smallness for many viewers. Which is unfortunate, because I love it. I love it so much. This feels so cramped, limited. But I know what must be done. Hmm. Hmm. That's not what I asked you to do. Oh well, it worked out too. Uh, why don't you... Thanks. Oops, uh, guide. Good, we do need to have a guide. Since he's gonna tell me how I make the Ankh charm. Oh, come on. Stop it. Can we? Can we make this? Thank you. I'm just trying to make my way through this chlorophyte. Yeah, I almost missed that. That would have been kind of bad. But it's okay for now. Once we have Spectre Armor, we can actually handle the... Um, the... Jungle Temple, probably. By probably, I mean definitely, honestly. Like, we, we can. So maybe that'll be uh, something that comes up soon. Oh, hello, Mimic. Dual hook. So that's a longer um, grappling hook, but I don't like it. You can't grapple multiple things at once. And, uh, yeah, you can shoot both at once, and it's faster, and like I said, longer. But not being able to grapple multiple things at once is just not how I like. I like being able to grapple lots of stuff. Oops. Oh, my God. I'm so not used to having the... Oh, this is chlorophyte. That's nice. I need to set up my mouse macros again. So that is, that's what's going to happen. Probably not right after this, and I'll probably forget for a few episodes or something. Ah, three. It's not three anymore. Mom, I'm not three anymore. Okay, I want to get down there. Can I do that a fast way? Nah. Fine, that's fine. What do I do with all my mud, anyway? Because, I mean, I'm not preparing to farm the Chlorophyte. I should, but it won't be hard to set up later, either. That's the thing. And that's going to make me be lazy about it. Is that another Mimic? I wonder. Oh my god, so many enemies right now. Demolitionist. Okay, it's not a Mimic. Just keep shooting things every so often. Hello, enemies galore. Just checking out life. Water chest? That's weird. Flipper? 
Yeah, I'm good with this chest now. Gotta look around for chlorophyte and life fruit. Alright. It's a weird place for life fruit, but I'm not gonna complain as long as it's there. 450, we're halfway to 500. Relative to where we were, of course, when we started, not uh, overall, because 250 is halfway to uh, 500, of course. Okay, oh, stop it, you. Fine, I'll do it this way. It's no big deal. Okay, I can't reach that. Fine. I do need to recover a little bit. What are these? Hunter and archery. Oh, I used archery potions. Never use uh, archery at all. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, that looks potentially promising. Let's get out of the water. Since water's actually now a negative, as opposed to a neutral. With some negative additives, I guess. So maybe, you know, water's not that much different than it was. Okay, I just want to look around a little. Keep on slashing my way through the world. So let's see, we have 33 bars and 51. We need to make 21 more bars. Yeah, 21 more bars, and that's 6 times 21, which is 6 plus... Um, 6 times 20 is like 1... By 120, I do mean 120. Yeah, I was actually right for once. That's a surprise. At least I think I was right. Chlorophyte, please. That's an interesting looking chest. Hope it's a mimic. Honestly, like, dual hooks worth selling. For uh, two gold, maybe? It's something. Not even a mimic. Eh, I guess I ain't mad. Dual hook. Maybe it's five gold. Maybe it's even more. I, I couldn't tell you. Oh, what was I even saying? I've lost my train of thought. Uh, up here. No need for stuff. 1080p also helps when caving, because you can see so much more. Like, Spelunker Potion, it feels like a waste to use at 720p. Because there's just so much that you miss. Ah, well. What do you have? More feral claws to sell. Cool. Alright, we're going down here. Sure, we'll keep going. Though over there looks interesting where that bee is. Oh, life fruit. Okay. <laughs> that pretty much dictates my movement. It's like, oh, I found a life fruit. Better go there. Life fruit probably sells reasonably well, also. Uh, yeah, thanks for emitting some light for me. Is that a little bit of chlorophyte? Looks like it. Let's tunnel down from here. Okay, um... Yeah, that's chlorophyte. We'll grab it. So anyway, we need 126, I think I decided. We're at 53. We're almost halfway there. Uh, right, 9. I'm not used to it being 9 now. Just looking around, looking about, trying not to get myself killed in a stupid manner. Angry Trapper. Why can't it be a not angry trapper? Can't it just be a trapper or a happy trapper? Maybe it loves its job of killing me. Oh, that's a mimic, because we can see that it's glowing with our hunter potion. So that's exciting, because I like uh, mimics right now. Something's hitting me. Alright, gonna hit up the mimic. And it's going to give me a Philosopher's Stone, which uh, reduces the Potion Sickness debuff. And that can combine with the uh, Band of Regeneration. 
the thing that regenerates our health ever so slowly. And two, make a charm of myths, and it just has both effects, basically. It's uh, quite simple, straightforward. 460, we're getting there. For sure, we're getting there. Okay, there are a lot of uh, dudes down there that I don't want to play with too much. Ghost. Ghost. Alright, let's... Uh, oops, oh, that's a lot of chlorophyte. I like it. So is 126 really the right answer? It really is. It's totally the right answer. I'm going to be honest with everyone and hope that I'm not wrong. Basically. I shouldn't be. Okay, what are we looking at? Anything up here? Of the intriguing variety of, oh my god, there's an angry trapper in my face. Okay, let's not die too hard. But then again, we do have a lot more life than we had. Many, well not many, uh, like very sh shortly ago. Okay, excuse me. Or excuse you, I suppose. It's not very kind of you to try and kill me when I'm busy. Sorry, I'm not answering. I don't remember the next line. Never mind. Alright, every little bit. Ooh, is that... is that something that we want? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, turtles have, like, rare drops of stuff to make turtle armor, which I guess is cool to have, most likely. Ah, 126 is so right. I know it. We're at 78, too, so... Make that a little more than 78. Don't make me... don't make me excited. Spectre armor, here we come! If I get a little bit extra, it happens. I mean, I'll clear out whatever veins I see of the ore. Ah, <sighs> Spectre Armor, that's a big turning point. It really is. The recovery for 8% of our magic damage? Really awesome. Okay, um, cool for this. Good job, Magnetosphere. It's not actually Magnetosphere. Disclaimer. <laughs> As if we haven't heard me call a magnet sphere enough times to know that, but still. Every so often someone takes something and just, like, takes what they want out of it instead of what the point was. Okay. 99. And that means... I need to get rid of something. Did I miss any? No, I didn't, but I'm going to get rid of stuff. Oh, wait. 99.17. So that's, like, 116. Oh, another goodie bag. Vine. I mean, honestly, I don't care about things that I should care about. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't. Okay. You're an easy kill. I don't need much more. I need, like, literally ten more chlorophyte. And then I'm, I'm done. With spectre armor, at least. Then I'll have to come back down here later for other things. But that's not the point. The point is that I'll have spectre armor. Yeah, sure, let's go down there. Wow! Enemies! Okay, now, now we're fine. Opening this up to get you... Uh, I'll use the Hunter Potions. Uh, any Chlorophyte around here? No. Should I have expected there to be? Maybe. This one's been a lot less uh, inventory intensive, which is good. And there's the last of the chlorophyte we need. Oh god, Wisp, you need to help me more. Really, please? Ugh, I hate my inability to change directions. Because the wisp needs to move. Sometimes that's annoying. Okay, wisp, help me out. There we go. Now I can get everything. Be done. Come back for a life fruit later. 
we did pretty well, actually. 460 in one session of a mere hour 40 minutes. <laughs> okay, so we, we're definitely overprepared. Let's just, uh, let's just do it. Goodie bag, rotten eggs, sure. Okay, grab our ectoplasm. Create our chlorophyte bars. Yep, we just overdid it a little bit, and then... Don't need any of the Spectre stuff so far besides Spectre pants, Spectre robes, and the Spectre hood. Full Spectre armor. Keep my titanium stuff, because I can, I suppose. Um, it has a nice bonus. I probably will never use it again, but that's not the point. The point is that it's here to be used, if ever. Chlorophyte, yeah, chlorophyte bars sell for a lot more than the ore does. Flipper. Dual hook I will keep, even though, you know, I don't have to. Okay. Now, Philosopher's Stone will go in here. All these things will go in the chest. Uh, dual hook will go in here too. Mud. Do I have like mud in a chest somewhere? Oh wow, another platinum. Go figure. Uh, so now I have 32 defense. It's a lot less, but it's also like kind of a lot more. So I have a 999 of mud. Now I have a 527 of mud. We're ready to make a chlorophyte farm if we ever really want to. Which for now I don't, to be honest. Okay, let's move you and all of you stuff over. Take that and that. Honestly, I don't need it in there. Cloud and our bundle of balloons can go in here, and 999 stone, I guess, can go in here. Flares go in here, I guess. Yes. And then we're clear for stuff that isn't uh, these unholy arrows that we don't need. Okay, fine. I will take this freaking soul cake thing. Oh, I should grab all the banners. May as well do that. That'll be nice to have. Um, strong golden shower. Yes, that's all the stuff. Okay, we've got it. Oh, hello, enemies. See? Healing. It's healing me. Okay, I'm gonna just... Yep, so this will keep me alive pretty well, and that means it goes really well with the mana cuffs because of the uh, extra mana when we get hit, and then getting hit isn't a big deal. Uh, it also increases my maximum mana by 80. So let's see, we've got 7% increased magic damage and crit chance, 10% uh, increased magic damage and crit chance, and 8% uh, increased magic damage and 8% increased movement speed. So that's cool. Uh, I will place these banners. Oh, I got a broken batwing that I don't think I had already. Okay, we have so many banners that I don't have space for right now. Broken Batwing, where am I keeping those? I think I'm keeping all these in here. Am I? Yes, yes I am. Alright, let's stack whatever, the, the stars, oh, and the pixie dust? Shouldn't I have pixie dust in here? Do I have pixie dust in here and I just don't know it? It looks like I don't, at a quick glance. And then a mushroom? Screw you, I'll eat you. Don't think I won't. Put away my money, uh, and that was a really successful episode. I hope so, because it was an hour and 44 minutes. But we're good. I don't really need to carry around the shadow key anymore. I don't need to carry around some things. Just, we'll worry about it later. So next time, I don't know what I'm going to do. But I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.